Welcome to episode 6. We're just checking out the nether wart farm here. And one of the comments in one of my last videos, somebody said, uh, nether wart only grows in light level 8 or below, so I might have to move some of my torches. But that seems to be not true, because uh, as you can see, that's grown just fine. This one here, that's fully grown right next to a torch. So thanks for the advice, but I think, I think it's untrue. So that's that. We got a little bit of nether wart here. We can brew up some potions. Let's go back to the nether wart, the overworld, and we'll see what's going on there. Ah, oh, the spider system. Okay, good news everyone. It works. Basically, I had to raise this up and put the iron fence there. I don't know why, but now the spiders all come in here and I guess they climb up and get stuck and they condense. They don't spread out like they were before. So this thing is now completely functional. I've been running it with both spawners running. Basically I, I stand here, put these blocks here because as you know in SMP the, the mob glitches are terrible. They spread out all over the place. So I have to basically push myself into that corner and wait. So what I think is going to happen is I need to make this look better. Um, it's it's a mess right now, so I think I'm going to go off camera, do some work. Now, I don't know what kind of materials to build it out of. I've always been preferential to stone brick, so I think that's what I'm going to do. We've got some cooked stone here. We're going to make some brick because that's what I like. We have the floor all ripped out here, and I put up the back wall, and I want to make it so that the switch for everything is here, because this is a stupid location, so we're going to move it. Now I'll have to rewire some of the redstone and run it behind, and the same as this route down here, we'll run it behind. Also I'm going to build a little automatic, actually I'm not going to mention it, I'm just going to build it and I'm going to show you guys what it does. It's for when you go AFK. So I need to go get some sticky pistons and I'll be right back. As you can see, there's a sticky piston. There's one back there also. And this is where you go AFK on this nether brick here. Hit that switch and these two walls come up. So like I said, the spiders, they'll just push you into this corner so you don't actually go out of the range of the spawners. And that's that. Now I have to... And it's just a switch runs redstone into these. That's it. Now I have to run this redstone down to connect with the spawner, and then I can fill it all in. Then it will be operational. I can't wait till I don't have to come down here anymore. It's such a disaster. Alright, next step, completion. Here it is, all completed. It looks a little sterile. Maybe we'll have to put, you know, some trim or something like that. Next step, fix these stairs. But first, let's give this thing a test. Well, it's a good thing we tested it, because they've pushed me out of my square. So I'm going to have to dig up this, put another piston in, so that we're really set into place. Now when I was testing this earlier, when I turned this off, one spider got out somehow. So let's see what happens. Nope, they're still not out. So now we can just chop them. SMP is so glitchy, it's hilarious. But as long as you know that's what's happening, you don't have to be afraid. Alright, so we'll fix that up, and then we'll start working on those stairs over there, because that doesn't look cool at all. We've ripped out the old stairs, all the pistons and redstone, and this is where the new stairs will be. As you can see, it's just laid out currently, and it looks terrible, like everything I build, but I'm going to brighten it up, and you'll see what it does. I, I think you'll be surprised. But... We'll just skip ahead to its completion because it's pretty much just covering everything up, making it look nice. So, let's skip ahead to that. 
I've decided to show you a little bit more than its completion because it is a little complex. Basically, it's going to be flat here until you step on these pressure plates. The floor will come apart and the stairs will come in. So, I'm working on that right now. That's what it looks like currently. But I need more slimes. I don't have enough sticky pistons. But we'll skip ahead to a little bit further. Here we are. It's looking like a real disaster area. There's redstone going everywhere. But I've run out of sticky pistons, so I cannot continue. Um, these pressure plates here, they work. Which is cool. But I need more sticky pistons. Because I need to set up pulse limiters. And I don't have any. So I think we're going to call the episode here. And then next episode I'll explain this a little bit more. You know, the T-flip-flop. And I'm going to... I'm going to see if that program that I used to tell you were basically slime chunks were and see if that still works and see if I can build a slime farm because we're done I, I can't do anything else so thanks for watching guys I'll see you next episode take care